on a letter and I'm sorry it's a little late. We've both been crazy over today. I'm thinking of you as I write this. I do love everything we have and will have in our future together. And that was me also trying to figure out like what he meant because you all want to decode this? <laughs> Can I see? <laughs> the screen. We're pretty convinced this was written last night when it was just him and his brother in the hotel room. <laughs> A river flows surely to the sea, darling. So it goes. Some things are meant to be. Michael Threckle, do you solemnly agree before God and these witnesses to take Tammy Jo Goodwin to be your lawful wedded wife, to love and respect her, honor and cherish her, and to live with her in all faith and tenderness, in health and in sickness, in prosperity and adversity, and forsaking all others to keep yourself only unto her, so long as you both shall live? I do. Tammy Jo Goodwin, do you solemnly agree before God and these witnesses to take Brandon Michael Threckle to be your lawful wedded husband, to love and respect him, honor and cherish him, and to live with him in all faith and tenderness, in health and in sickness, in prosperity and adversity, and forsaking all others, to keep yourself only unto him, so long as you both shall live? I do. And as much as Tammy and Brandon have now consented together in holy wedlock and have declared the same before God in the presence of this company, I now pronounce them husband and wife in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Those whom God had joined together, let no one put asunder. You may kiss the bride. It gives me great pleasure to introduce to you Mr. and Mrs. Brandon and Tammy Jo Threckle.
think I want to marry you. Okay. I'd like to thank all of you for being here for Brandon and Tammy Joe's big day. For those of you who don't know, I've been involved in both Brandon's family and Tammy's family since, wow, like 1985 or so. Yeah, yeah. So it's, uh, it's a great honor for me to be here. But uh, a little backstory on this. There was a point in time where myself and Brandon's other friends were a little concerned about him. He was making some strange choices. He, he gave up beer and he was drinking White Claw. He, uh, he, he took down his Bruce Jenner poster from the Olympics and put up a Caitlyn Jenner poster. <laughs> There was a, a lot of things that you know, we, were, we were really concerned about. We were getting ready to take away his man card. So uh, our friends, we all got together at my house one day. We had people locally. We had people from across the country on speed dial. And uh, we, were, we were trying to figure out what we could do to help him through his, his low point. And we decided we needed to get a woman in his life. So. <laughs> Through trial and error, you know, we had, we had a, a, a bunch of guys who were married and they couldn't partake in, in getting a girl. So, you know, it fell on a couple of us. Steve, Steve worked very hard for you. Robert, Robert worked very hard for you. I tried myself. And, and one day, suddenly, Tammy Jo was there. And, and listen, I understand a lot of you guys are, are, are working the food service industry, so you're going to understand this. We were kind of concerned because she was a Denny's girl. It, it was weird. It was weird. So for once, we finally saw that little bit of spark in Brandon's eye again, and it, it was really exciting to us. But, but Tammy's, Tammy's pretty shrewd. She's a businesswoman, and she's like, Listen, I got the skills and I got the tools, but this isn't going to come out for free. <laughs> so she wrote up a contract, and there were a bunch of clauses in the contract. And, and me and the other nine guys, we, we've been paying her for a long time. <laughs> but, but, Tammy Joe, I want you to read the first escape clause. In the event of marriage, you now own him. We're done. There's no more payments. <laughs> But seriously, please, everybody raise their glasses. Here is to Brandon and Tammy Joe. May there be hundreds of memories, thousands of days, and a full lifetime ahead of you. Hello. <laughs> if you stop talking, you can hear me. For those of you who don't know me, I'm Natalie, Brandon's niece. Um, Tammy, you look like a real life princess today and we all get to witness it. Uncle Brandon, you already look like a beast on the regular, so there's nothing new today. <laughs> it is already an honor to be up here celebrating the day that, with the two of you and watch the two of you fall in love with over the years. You two truly balance each other out and fit each other like two halves turned into a whole. And let's be honest, Tammy really puts Uncle Brandon in his place, which is needed every day. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> Thanks, Dad. Tammy Jo, I am so excited. I now get to call you my aunt. Don't worry, you're already my favorite. <laughs> oh my god. I am so glad we all get to witness the two of you find your happily ever after. And cheers to our very own Beauty and the Beast. And to the new Mrs. and Mr. Tammy Jo Threckled. <laughs> I gave him three days. <laughs>
lost, you found a way to bring me back Needed forgiveness, you always gave me that Girl, I'm a witness of your love Cause you don't be giving up And it's crazy how you saved me Hand on the Bible, don't know how I got you But I couldn't ask for more Girl, what we got's worth thanking God for so thank God I get to wake up by your side And thank God your hand fits perfectly in mine And thank God you love me when you didn't have to But you did and you do and he knew Thank God for giving me you Thank God, thank God for giving me you Congratulations, Tammy. Have good life. It was a beautiful wedding. I love you. <laughs> I, don't, I don't say it very often. Thank God your hand fits perfectly in mine. And thank God you love me when you didn't have to. But you did and you do. And he knew. Thank God for giving me you. Girl, what we got's worth thanking God for So thank God I get to wake up by your side And thank God your hand fits perfectly Wedding day, Tammy! Happy yeah, yeah, wedding day! Yeah. Yes. Welcome to the party! You better do what I want! Hey. Gentlemen. We 